this is how you make a very, very deadly dinner in 30 minutes. So to get us started on Big Deli TV, we got the potatoes chopped up in nice round circles here. We're going to throw them in this pot of water, get them boiled real quick to get them soft. After that, we're going to fry those bad boys up with some lemon pepper and some salt. And then over here, we got just a bag of mixed vegetables that we're going to boil up to heat up. That's going to be good. Can't forget about those pork chops. I put them in the microwave to defrost because I didn't leave them out like I was supposed to. So that's what happens when you defrost them in the microwave. They get a little cooked around the edges. But that's not going to hurt at all. Still going to be deadly. Turn the heat on these vegetables. Those are going to heat up pretty fast. You know what? I'm going to do that last, actually. I'm going to start by boiling the water back here in this back pot. That way, if I do things right, everything will be done in order. Be ready to go. Got that water boiling in the pot. About to season that water with some salt and drop those potatoes in. Got some garlic chopped up. I'm going to throw in with some butter on this frying pan to season the pan up as I put the pork chops on. So that's going to give it some good, good deliness right there. Ooh, I'm getting excited. Ladies, if you wish you had a man like Big Deli that would cook your dinner every night, smash that like button and show some love. Subscribe to the channel because more Big Deli videos are coming out every week. Season this boiling water up with some salt. I'm going to drop these potatoes in there. Let them boil for probably about 10 minutes. Now I'm only doing this to get them a little soft, not fully soft to where they're pretty much you can make a mashed potatoes. I just want them a little soft because after this I'm going to fry them up. Not deep fry, just pan fry. These things are so good. If you like fries, if you like potatoes, if you like hash browns, hit that like button for me. If you want to see more deadliness, please subscribe. Over here, I'm about to get this uh, pork chop pan heated up. I cook my pork chops kind of similar as I would a steak. I like to get my pan nice and hot. I'm going to drop some butter and some garlic on that bad boy. And then, I'm going to drop these pork chops on there and watch them sizzle. I like to let them sit on there until they get a nice crust on each side and it looks so deli. Ooh, can't wait for dinner. Got some butter on the pan, letting that sizzle up a little bit. Don't really like my stove set up because this shit is so off balance. Wait till I put this freaking pan down. You'll see the butter slide either to all the way to the left or all the way to the right. That's how you know when it shit's off balance. Uh, but what can you do? Living the broke life. Big deli household. Gotta make some deli food what you got. Butter's on the pan. Let's drop the garlic. Put some of that deliness on that pan. Let it simmer in there. Ooh, that's gonna be good. Drop another tablespoon of butter. Not really a tablespoon, like a teaspoon. Drop that in there. Let that simmer up. That pan has got so much flavor on it right now with that garlic and that butter. Go ahead and drop a comment of what you like to cook with garlic. I love garlic. I put it in everything pretty much. So at this point, my potatoes are about as done as I want them. I'm going to take those out, start prepping those to fry. Over here, my butter and my garlic are heated up nicely. I'm about to drop these pork chops on here and let those uh, cook up. Get nice and crispy on each side. I like a nice crust on my pork chops. So it's so good when it's like that. And over here, I'll turn the vegetables on last. So once everything's done, it'll all be done together. You can serve it nice and hot, fresh, making very, very deli. Put a smile on a beautiful woman's face.
about to drop those pork chops on. If you guys don't know anything about cooking, always wash your hands before you touch the food. Make sure to be clean, my delians. Oh, yeah. Drop that on there. My pork chops are nice and seasoned up. All I put on them are uh, salt and lemon pepper. I'm going to let the frying pan do the rest of the work. We're going to enjoy this bad boy as soon as it's done. Alright my delians, it's starting to smell really good again in the big deli kitchen. Those pork chops are frying up nicely. Got those pit potatoes frying up nicely behind them. Vegetables we gonna turn on in a couple minutes here once everything's almost done. Ain't shit in that pot. But yeah, that's what we got going on right now. It's almost done. Probably about another 10 minutes. Be able to plate this bad boy and then eat it. Oh, I can't wait. I'm so hungry. About time to flip these pork chops. Oh yeah, look at that crust, baby. Ladies and gentlemen, this is how I love my pork chops. It's got a nice, beautiful crust on the outside of it. Can get the pork out of this one. These pork, cho pork chops are plumping up. Coming over. Oh, that one's a little crispy. That one's going to be mine, not hers. Ha <laughs> ha! They still very, very deadly when they crispy on the outside like this. It's actually only the seasoning that we put on there that crispens up like that. So it's like the lemon pepper. Gets a little black on the outside, but it's still very, very good. Potatoes back here frying up still. Oh, it's smelling so good in here. So, so good. Potatoes are looking good. Pork chops are done pretty much. Got the heat off, letting no those sit. Vegetables are going, letting that boil up and heat up. And once those are good, we're good to go. About to plate this bad boy up and max out. I'm so hungry and I'm ready for this deliness. Oh, smash that like button, my delians, and subscribe. There they are, my delians. The two beautiful his and hers plate. This is how you make a very, very deli dinner in 30 minutes. Simple, easy lemon pepper pork chops with some lemon pepper potatoes. Some vegetables in the middle. Oh, so deli. So deli.